are better ways to keep cool. Call KS Services and receive a new Bryant unit with no payments and no interest for 18 months. Stay cool now and pay later. Visit callks.com for more. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is for Thursday, the 17th of December. I'm James Spann. Alabama's weather dry today and tomorrow. Some rain at times over the weekend. It just may be cold at Christmas next week. Here we go. This is the upper air look across the country. Got that big snowstorm continuing over the northeast United States. That'll be winding down later today. Drier air slowly pushing in here. Pretty cold this morning, mostly low and mid-30s. Clouds are hanging tough as expected. 32 for Aniana and Coleman and Haleyville, Birmingham 35. We're expecting clearing today with a high only in the mid-40s this afternoon, about 10 degrees below average. There's the watch warning map. Winter storm warnings are still in effect for parts of the northeast United States, and again, that'll be winding down later today. And out west, scattered winter weather advisories there. Things are quiet down here across the deep south. There's the severe weather outlook today. Things pretty quiet. Tomorrow, maybe some thunder for parts of East Texas and the Arklatex region. And day three, the uh, guys at SPC have put the risk of a few thunderstorms in place for parts of Alabama. Probably not much, if any, thunder, but certainly no chance of any severe weather. This is the rain for the next seven days. And you can see uh, down here across the deep south, rain amounts under a half inch for most spots. This is valid through Thursday morning of next week. So, model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS. This is the 06 c run, 3 o'clock today. Troughing in the west, troughing in the east, ridging in between. And for us, a drier air mass dropping in. So, morning clouds giving way to a partly sunny afternoon. Highs in the 40s for the northern half of the state. Tomorrow, we start the day well down in the 20s. But the sky will be sunny. The high will be in the 50s. That'll feel like a heat wave. That'll feel pretty good. Now, this is Saturday. And again, we've seen variations in the timing here. But the GFS suggesting during the day we could be dry. Clouds increasing. Then we'll have a chance of showers in here Saturday night. This is Saturday night at midnight. And again, moisture limited. We don't expect any especially heavy rain. And I guess there might be a clap of thunder somewhere. But I'm not so sure that'll happen. And then Sunday, this run is a little slower. It keeps the uh, showers in place on through Sunday morning. Uh, in fact, uh, if you take this run on face value, the better chance of showers this weekend would be from midnight Saturday night until about noon Sunday. And then Sunday afternoon, the better chance of rain shifting down into South Alabama. Highs over the weekend most likely will be in the 56 to 60 degree range. Monday, that feature is on by. We're dry. Highs in the 50s. Tuesday should be a beautiful day. We could see low 60s in here. Now, this is Wednesday. You can see the uh, new system getting its act together to the west. We're still dry. Again, low 60s are pretty good possibility. It's going to feel great. And then this is a week from today, Thursday, December 24th, Christmas Eve. There's that big old deep trough digging down over the eastern half of the nation, pushing a cold front in here. And that will bring a batch of showers. There could be some thunderstorms. I don't think we have any severe weather with this. And again, uh, if you're looking for a white Christmas, better head to the Great Lakes way up north. Uh, we see no chance of any snowflakes down here. But then cold, yeah, this is Christmas Day, December 25th. Look at the thickness values, the 540 line down to Mobile. If this verifies, highs would be only in the 30s for the northern half of the state. But this is the European, and it's not as cold and not as amplified. And this would suggest a high close to 50. So, again, based on the uh, ensembles, we're going to use highs in the 40s and lows in the 20s on Christmas Day and dry and should be sunny. We'll go out uh, to the end of the period, out 10 days. This is the uh, day after Sunday, Saturday the 26th, the northwest flow aloft. And, again, a dry air mass, a sunny day and pretty cool. So this is the snow output for Birmingham. And again, some of the members pick up a few flakes here and there, but this is basically nothing more than noise. We see no winter storm issues here for a while. And this carries us on through the end of the month. And rain for the same time period, the mean, only about one to two inches uh, based on the European ensemble here. Temperatures, you can see the warm-up next week with potential for low 60s on Tuesday and Wednesday. And then we turn cold for Christmas. And again, uh, we're forecasting currently highs in the 40s and lows in the 20s at the end of next week. And the CPC outlook, December 24th through the 30th. And if this verifies, temperatures below average for the east, above average 
for the central and western states. That's it for the Weather Extreme video today. We'll have notes on the blog. We are on a holiday schedule, for me at least. I'll be doing one video today and tomorrow. But again, I'll post some fresh notes on the blog later this afternoon. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless. Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no-interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today.